If you like our video, click the button to subscribe to our channel and get easy access to new content. To see our full suite of ad-free video courses, instruction manuals, and quick reference guides, visit us at www.teachucomp.com. The Brush Preset Picker Panel in Photoshop lets you select from preset brushes and create your own custom brushes. To show the Brush Preset Picker in Photoshop, click the Click to Open the Brush Preset Picker button in the Options Bar Control Panel after selecting the Brush Tool in the Tools Panel. The Brush Preset Picker Panel then appears as a drop-down panel in Photoshop. You can click the same button again to close it after making any change to the settings within it. Note that you can use the Brush Preset Picker with almost any painting tool in Photoshop, like the History Brush Tool or Background Eraser Tool, for example. However, the options that appear in the Brush Preset Picker panel change depending on the tool selected. The Brush Preset Picker shows frequently changed brush tip settings for the selected painting tool at the top of its panel. These settings often include the brush's size, hardness, roundness, and angle. For many tools, these settings appear as sliders and adjacent value fields. However, the angle and roundness values also often appear as a circle icon containing two solid circles on its perimeter. You can click and drag to adjust the roundness of the circle, and an arrow you can click and drag to adjust the angle of the brush tip. The Brush Preset Picker panel also shows a listing of preset brushes for some painting tools, like the Brush Tool for example, at the bottom of the panel. These preset brushes appear within Brush Group folders in the list. You can click the arrows next to the names of the Brush Group folders to expand and collapse them to show or hide the preset brushes they contain. If a brush preset is used by a specific painting tool, the icon for the painting tool appears in the upper right corner of the brush preset in this list. If you select one of these brush presets, you will also switch the active tool in Photoshop to that painting tool. So watch out for this when you are first learning how to select brush presets. To select a brush preset, click it to select it within the list in the Brush Preset Picker panel. Doing this applies the Brush Preset's brush settings, which may appear in the Brush Preset Picker panel, although this panel doesn't show all brush settings, which we will discuss in a later lesson. If you select a preset brush with a defined size, and then adjust the size slider in the Brush Preset Picker panel, you can click the Restore to Original Size button next to the Size field to reset it to its default size if needed. A listing of the most recently selected brush tips also appears in a list above the listing of brush presets. You can click any brush tip here to reselect it again if needed. Alternatively, to search for a brush by name, Type it into the search box above the list of brushes to filter the list of brushes below by name. To view the options for the Brush Preset Picker panel, click its Options button in the upper right corner of the Brush Preset Picker panel to view a drop-down menu of commands. The commands in this menu let you change the content shown in the Brush Preset Picker panel, create new brushes and brush groups, load, delete, and rename brushes, and load additional brush sets. Remember to click the subscribe button to see more of our videos. See our full suite of courses, instruction manuals, and quick reference guides at www.teachucomp.com.